take a look at what's happening around Northwest Arkansas, sponsored by Canada Dry. Now, if you've thought about becoming a yoga instructor, or maybe you just want to deepen your practice, yeah. or if you're curious about what it even takes to become a certified yoga instructor, well, guess what? Yoga Story in Bentonville, they're hosting a free teacher training info meeting. You have the option of attending this one in person or virtually, so all you need to do is sign up. The meeting will last from 7 to 7.30 this evening. I'm actually following a girl on Instagram. Uh, she just got her yoga, yoga certification. Yeah, she that's sells great. like 400 hours wow. of training. Yeah. Wow, that's intense. Yeah, it's good sure. to know that you're in good hands of professionals yes. when you go uh, to have a yoga session for sure. Hey, let's take a look at a couple of events that are happening tomorrow that you're going to want to know about. You can okay. sign up today. So first up, get ready for the Razorback Women's Basketball season and by joining them for a virtual tip-off celebration. Now, of course, due to COVID-19, the celebration will be held virtually okay. tomorrow, Wednesday, November 18th. Uh, the event is open to all Razorback fans, and it's set to start at 6 p.m. via Zoom. And at the event, you're going to hear about the upcoming 2021 Razorback women's basketball season and what to expect from the team. You can RSVP for the event now, and if you do that, you can submit any questions you might have for Coach Mike Neighbors as well. Nice. Yeah. Also happening tomorrow, um, if you're an entrepreneur and you're seeking funding, listen up. Startup Junkie is hosting a virtual event where you can learn the basics of grant writing. We know grant writing oh, is man. super important. Um, it's how you use, yeah. of course, to get your funds to start up your business. Plus, uh, they were going to give you an overview of where you can find grants that fit your needs. The event is happening tomorrow. It is free. Uh, it's going to be held during the lunch hour from noon until 1. I love that. If your family is looking for a way to give back to our community, then Fayetteville Parks and Recreation wants you. Parks and Rec, along with the Recycling and Trash Division, uh, are hosting a final fall cleanup. Streets, trails, parks, and lakes have seen more litter this year due to increased outdoor activities. Individuals and groups of less than 10 who participate in self-guided cleanups from now through December 18th will receive a t-shirt while supplies last. And for events on, uh, for details on how to participate in this cleanup or more information on any of our happening in NWA stories, all you need to do is head over to our website, gooddaynwa.com.